be the mother of his child, he's not leaving anymore. <laughs> I trapped him. <laughs> Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Welcome back, people. To the Olawanis. Um, I'm Dewey and this is King. Um, and today we're just going to be talking about how we found out I was pregnant. Oh. Yeah. 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 Interesting. Yeah, so we're just gonna get into the story now. How did I find out I was pregnant? Woo child. Okay, so basically. Me and King got back together, and a few months after, yeah, I was just on a night shift, and so I'm a nurse, I'm a mental health nurse, and at that time I used to do, sometimes I used to do night shift extra on the side, um, and one night shift, I just had the worst heartburn and indigestion, I was just laying there thinking, I've never felt like this before, this is unlike me, this is unlike my body, and so the next morning I decided to go do a pregnancy test and I found out I was pregnant. So I, what I, th this was in January, what I would have liked to do to like let King know that I was pregnant was that I was planning that on Valentine's Day, February the 14th, I would tell him that I'll give it to him as a gift, but he decided to argue on, with me on that day. <laughs> Yes, you did. You decided to argue with me on that day. Yeah, I was watching. Well, I was working at night. No, no, no. I remember, I blessed. Basically, you. We were arguing the day I found out. Remember, I said something to you on the phone. I said, "Don't argue with me. I'm pregnant." No, that's not. How it, no, that's not how it worked. But you didn't hear me. Oh. Okay. And then. Oh yeah, yeah. You I'm kept gonna... on asking me. So basically, I found out I was pregnant in the morning. And he called me straight after I did the pregnancy test. In my head, I already told my my, my younger sister that I would like to just give it to him as a gift on Valentine's Day. But when he called me, he kept he kept on like just asking me like why wasn't I picking up the phone? Because I didn't pick up the phone for like about three hours because I was still trying to digest it. I was kind of, I was really excited. I was like oh my god, then I didn't want to pick up the phone because I didn't want it to let him know yet. But then when I picked up the phone. He started saying like, why have you been picking up the phone? Because I think I was meant to like... Have yeah, it. three hours, come on. What were you spending to do? Three hours not picking up my call, no nothing. Of course I'll be vexed. Then yeah, so, be vexed. yeah so he was angry, he well, was vexed. And um, I was just telling him like... I was just saying to him, stop arguing with me, stop arguing with me, stop arguing with me. And they just kept on going like... And then I said to him, I'm pregnant, stop arguing with me. And he didn't hear what I said, but then he kept on asking me, what did you say, what did you say? I was like, nothing, 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 because I still wanted to go along with my plan of telling him Valentine's Day. I just kept on asking me, what is it? Was, and then I was like, I'm pregnant. Then no, I was like, that's not then I was like, I'm joking. Oh yeah, 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 so yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine you're joking, you're pregnant, you're saying you're joking. I said, I'm joking, I'm joking. So then throughout that day, all the way to my next night shift, he kept on asking me, um, you did, are you, did, you just, did you say you're joking? Just just tell me now if you're pregnant because if you don't tell me that, you're, if you don't tell me you're pregnant, um, I'm not, I'm gonna, and then I find out later, I know you lied on my child. I was just, what did you say? You remember what you said? <laughs> I don't remember all that. Are you really serious? So he kept on asking, no, but he kept on asking me that. What I don't did remember I say? all what did that. I say? Yeah, this is him. I don't remember saying all of that part after that. No, 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 you didn't. Like, yeah, yeah, that's, that's how I came up with that. Like, no, me that's how you came out to tell me that. Like, you, you know, I told me it was, you called me. No, the video. Not, yeah, but don't you remember me saying that, um, I'm joking, and then you kept on asking, are you joking? Are you joking? If you're not, if you, you better tell me now if you're not joking. You don't remember that. That's what when you was when you was in the car, innit? Wasn't it in the car? Yeah, yeah. It wasn't. Bef it was before I got to the, to work. I don't remember like that. All I remember was she called me on a video. Oh yeah, I was I was working night shift, and then she just said to me, Yo, "Yeah, you want to tell me something?" Yeah, you want to tell me something, innit? Yeah, after all your while, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, after all your while, Yeah, you, the while, you probably caused the while anyway. But yeah, so then. Told me no. She showed me the the, the picture. I showed her the picture, and then I screen recorded yeah. his. Um, I'll probably ins I'll definitely insert it. 
So yeah. Well, it wasn't, I don't know how I felt, man. You know, it's yeah. Like growing up, and then you're thinking, you know, like, you know, you'll have your own family. You know, see what your own child would look like. You know, act around you and everything. And then initially, I actually thought that when I find out that, you know, she's pregnant or say a girl in general is pregnant, or well, obviously it was you, I was pregnant. I thought I'd be scared. Is it? Yeah, I actually thought I'd be scared, like. Uh, but that's when you know you're yeah, you're sure that like, you're sure by yourself. You know whatever you're doing, you know you're you're on the right path. You know, like, I was not even scared. I was actually excited. I was over the moon, man. I was like, you know what? Like this is actually a reality. And then yeah, man. And then after we came off the phone, yeah. Yeah. I was just thinking to myself, that way. That like, I need to sleep, wake up, and I know that yeah, that it's not no just that like, this could be some dream that makes it too real. Yeah. And then the next day, I was like, rah, I'm actually gonna be a dad. And that's the way I was outside at that moment. Yeah, so basically, the way I told him, we were both on the night shift, and I sent him the picture and I recorded his reaction. Yeah, so it was quite boring compared to the plan that I initially had, which was to give it to him as a gift on Valentine's Day and record it. That would it. have been good. That would have been really nice. That would have been good. But you could have done yourself. No, no, no. Yes, no. Like, Your Wahana was I'm too pregnant. much. I'm pregnant. I'm pregnant. Yeah, no. yeah. I'm pregnant. Don't argue. Don't argue. Don't argue. Don't argue. You don't argue with a pregnant woman. You don't argue with a pregnant woman. No, you don't argue. Exactly. <laughs> you don't argue with a pregnant woman. Yeah, 100%. You don't. But I didn't know you are pregnant. One. Two, yeah. You're a pregnant woman. You should know not to be arguing as well. This is, this is, this is like... You, you don't expect just one person to help you. You need to help yourself too. Well, so I was just, I was just like, excited hey, to you, use that you excuse. That I'm pregnant. You don't do that to me. <laughs> nah, she, no, you, what, let me tell you what happened. Yeah, you, she felt like she was in the movie. Innit? You know, in the movie scene where they're arguing, they're like, oh, "I'm pregnant," <laughs> and then the black guy was like, "What did she say?" I said, oh, "Baby, I love you." I'm like, oh, sorry, baby, okay. He didn't even hear what I said. <laughs> yeah, I didn't hear what she said because I'm like, "Bro, pick up the call, innit? Three hours, blood." <laughs> when he talks like that, I'm just like, "That's not what I said." I was like, "Yeah, like, come on." Yeah. So hey, why did you pick up your call, man? It's three hours. It's three hours, baby. That's how I talk. Yeah, right. Anyway, when I found out I was pregnant, I was over the moon. I was happy because the time when we were together previously in the past, I was already to have his baby. I was already ready to have his babies. I was ready to have his babies. I was ready to pop them out. So, you know, I was very, very happy. I was like, yes, I'm gonna be the mother of his child. He's not leaving anymore. <laughs> I trapped him. No, I trapped him. <laughs> no, 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 no what happened, you know, the time where obviously we broke up. Because I remember I said to her the dream in it. Yeah. Yeah, so I think that's part of the reason why I wasn't scared when she said she was pregnant. You know, because it's kind of like God showed it to me already. Yeah. But yeah, anyway. He already was... told me, like, before I got pregnant, he already told me the story that I had when we weren't together. So he told me a story that he had when we were not together. Yeah. And then it kind of came into fruition. That's another video. <laughs> if you want to know, yeah, comment, subscribe, like, share. And then, yeah, we're gonna tell you that story of what she's trying to talk about over there, innit? But yeah, man, now, you know, trust me, being a father, yeah, best thing ever. Yeah. Yes, there's the old, you know, sleepless night, all of that stuff, but it's amazing. It's, it's one of the ones where, where it's like, um, say you have a car, your dream car, yeah, your dream car, and then you're, you're paying finance, whatever, like installments, you know, you'd be happy paying that car because that's like your dream car, you know, a car that you know you do. Do everything to get like, account. That's how it feels like. That's how it feels like. But that's how excited I'm, I am in it. But it's like just being a dad, man. It's mad. It's mad. I, like, I, I can actually lose sleep for her. It's cool. Yeah. Anyway. But yeah, man. So guys, man, that was the experience. You know, when she told me, to, you know, that I was gonna be a dad. And how she found out as well. Yeah. Amazing. Years apart, but what God is, what God put together. Like you meant to be, you meant to be, and that's just how I see it. Oh yeah. One of the first people I told was my sister and my mom. So as soon as my mom came back in from work, she's a night shift as well. So she came back in from work. I was like, Mom, I need to tell you something. I was meant to keep my mouth shut, but I was literally everybody. Was exactly. Scared. She couldn't even wait for Valentine. She told me the same night. I was telling 
But that's what did like the, oh, yeah, yeah, the same day. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the same day. Yeah. Exactly. But yeah, um, my mom was like, "Okay, make sure you don't tell anybody that yeah you have to wait till twelve weeks, so you don't tell anyone. We keep this hush hush." And she came in from work with her friend, right? And her friend was in the sitting room, and she came upstairs to meet me to, for me to tell her this information. By the time I went downstairs, my mom already told her friend. You're joking. She already told her friend. And she was telling me. She said no one. Huh? She said she didn't tell no one. She said she did not tell anyone. And then by the time I went downstairs, she already told her friend that she's there smiling. And her friend was like, ah, is this the one that's pregnant? And my mom was just smiling like, like, why are you why, why are you, are you talking? Like, you must keep a, you must keep a secret, keep, yeah. in it, you know. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that was our story. Yeah, man. So that was the story, guys, man. Yeah, so anyway, subscribe, like, share, comment, like I already said, you know. And thank you guys. Thank you so much. We love you. Love you guys, man. Bye. Bye.